one of the ways we determine what kind of nest it is. Come on, come on up. It's okay. One of the ways we determine what kind of nest it is is if we see feathers in the nest, that's a tree swallow nest. If it's just sticks, then that's a bluebird nest. So what we do, you can see here it's labeled Santa Barbara and it's box number three. Here's, here's the flap mechanism I was telling you about. So when it comes time to, to catch the adults, we'll hook a, a fishing line and we'll walk out there so we're you know, not too close to the box to scare the birds. And they'll fly in and we'll just pull the line and whoop, they're trapped. So that's how we, and then we come over. And we'll just lower the box. Now you'll notice. You'll notice that there's a hook here. And then we can carefully open it up. And you'll see over on the inside, you see the tree swallow nest. It's obviously vacant. If you look closely, there's an old egg in there. So this nest oh, failed. It's, um, it's underneath. Yep, that's a white egg. Old it's egg. it's mm -hmm. old. It's drying it's up. Old yeah, the feathers are beautiful. <laughs> tree tree <clears throat> swallow. Tree swallow. Yep. Mm. So at various stages, you know, we'll see that. There's an egg, yep, I knew it just failed. If we'll come, you know, if we'll come one week and there are two eggs, they generally lay five eggs. We'll come back the next week and there'll be five eggs. And then the next week we'll see five little chicks or four, you know, three. And then we just do this throughout their gestation and their development and, and record it and come up with all kinds of data. So but you can see there's a box over there. And then right behind this willow, there's another box. And that box behind this willow was the only box out of 22 boxes this year that had Western bluebirds in it, which is kind of unusual. They're usually more prolific here. And for some reason this year, there was only one nesting pair. Generally, the tree swallows are more aggressive and they'll chase the bluebirds away. But we have so many, you'd think they'd share. You know, they'd be better sharers with the bluebirds. They probably scared them away. They probably did. There's a, a bird on the top of that pile of stuff. 